Hello, my name is Chris, and today we're going to take a quick look at how to display data with a tree map using Microsoft Excel. First, select both sets of category labels and the numbers, and then go to the Insert tab on the menu bar and click the Tree Map icon, and then choose the tree map. And just like that, Excel creates a tree map for you. First, the tree map is a little bit small for my liking, so I'll click and drag on the corner to make it larger and easier to work with. Next, I'll add the title by simply copying and pasting the title from the spreadsheet. Now, this tree map shows us the composition and the relative value of exports to the United States. But we also have data reporting the percentage of change compared to last year. To see which commodities are falling short, I will highlight the column containing the percentage of change and then click on the Home tab. And finally, I'll choose the conditional formatting icon. From the drop down menu, I'm going to select Highlight Sales Rules, which will open up this dialog box. Now I want to highlight the cell values that are less than zero in red. And with a click on the OK button, all the negative percentage changes are now in red. Next, I want to be able to easily identify which commodities in the tree map had a negative percentage change compared to last year. I will double click on each of the negative percentage change commodities, which will open up the formatting panel on the right hand side. Next, I'll select a solid line border, change the color to black, and then increase the width to two points. Now I have a tree map that not only shows the composition and the value of exports to the United States, but it also identifies which commodities saw a decrease compared to the previous year, which in turn will help people make a data-driven decision about where the focus should be for future trade relations.